All right, boys and girls, and welcome to Gordon Guitar. So, Khalid here again on this channel. We had him before, this time featuring Majid Jordan with the song called Open. So, we have um, this chords here, pretty easy to handle, and we have a melody here. I'm gonna give you one way of playing this, and this will um, be played in different ways uh, during this song here. I will give you one example. So let's start with this cool song here. No need for any capo. And we have four different chords to, um, to learn here. So the first chord will be A sus2. So that will be open A, second D, second G, open B, and open E. All right, the next will be C sharp minor. Okay, so you need to bar the fourth fret here from the A string and down, so five strings. And the rest will be six here on D, six on G, and fifth on B. Then we move this grip one string up here. Still on the fourth fret, you bar all strings this time, and we will play the G sharp. So all strings barred here on the 4th fret and the rest will be 6 on the A string, 6 on D and 5th on G. So that is the G sharp chord. And the final chord will be a standard A. So that is open A, 2nd D, 2nd G, 2nd B and open E. And you will play this song in this chord progression during the whole song here, okay? So, um, for this start here of this uh, song here, the opening, you can say for your song, uh, you will play four rounds of this chord progression here, A sus2, C sharp minor, G sharp, and A. And um, how you play this one is very simple here. You're just gonna pluck the strings, that's the best way, since we want to emphasize certain notes here from these different chords. So. To start with here with the A sus2, you want to emphasize the open E string. Okay, so what I do here, I play and I pluck the strings together here, the A string, the G, the B and the E. These four strings and I use my, of course, my four fingers here, my thumb, index, middle and ring finger with my right hand here, on my right hand. So these are the strings I pluck here. And then I go to the C sharp here. And I pluck the same strings here. I want to emphasize the fourth fret on the E string. This one. So I play the A, the G, B, and E string. Okay. The next chord is the G sharp. And here we want to emphasize the fourth fret on the G string. So therefore I'm plucking the four strings. Uh, from the bass and down here. So that means the E string, A, D, and G. Like that. And for the A here, I want to emphasize the second fret on the B string. So therefore, I'm plucking the A, the D, the G, and the B. Okay. So that is how you're gonna play this one. And you're gonna play this chord progression for four rounds here, the first verse. So um, you're gonna play it in this rhythm here. Okay, so. Okay, so. One, two. Okay, so um, if you want, you can do one beat like that after each chord there, so.
Okay, so I did some extra here, ups and downs. You don't have to, it's cool to just keep it clean here. If you wish, you could do like, yeah, you pluck and up and then clap. That's just uh, additional material here. You don't need that actually, just make it simple and basic here. Go for four rounds with the plucking and if you wish, hit the clap after each chord and that's great for this first verse. The rest of the song is pretty much based upon a um, melody here that is also based on these chords here, okay? So we use the same chords, but now different grips, okay? So I'm gonna show you one variation here of what you could play. And this variation is played and some parts of the song here, then it changes and it's just too much to uh, to cover on one tutorial. So I'll just give you one example here and it's up to you to play and play play with it. Just uh, uh, experience the, the chords here and play notes from them and it will sound great. That's what they do in this song here. But this one I will give you here. So you're gonna place your fingers up here. The first chord based on the same chord, A sus 2. The grip looks like this. So what I do here, I bar the fourth fret here from the G string and down, okay? And then I add the fifth fret on the B string. And then my little pinky goes up here to the seventh fret on the D string. That is the grip. And I include even the open A string here. So you're just gonna play the strings from the A and down. So that means open A, seventh on D, fourth on G, fifth on B, and fourth on E. And it sounds like this. Okay. From the A string and down. Like that, okay. The next will be based upon, of course, the C sharp minor. So you grab the chord, that is the easiest way. So take the C sharp minor here. You're gonna play this part, okay? So that is fourth on A, six on D, six on G, and fifth on B. So far, everything is from the grip. And as soon as you played the fifth on B here, you're gonna hammer on the seventh on B. So when you play this note here, you hammer on the seventh on B and you pull off and to get the fifth on B again. So slowly it will be like. Notice I'm just hitting the fifth on the B. The rest is hammer on and pulled off. Like that, okay? So that was the C sharp minor. Next chord will be, of course, the G sharp here. You go up and you grab the chord, the actual chord here. And when you have that, you're gonna play the fourth on E string, six on A, six on D, and fifth on the G string. So far, everything from the chord. And here, the same case here, as soon as you play the fifth on the G, you're gonna play this part here. So that means you're gonna use the same technique there, hammer on and pull off. This time you hammer on the sixth fret on the G string and you pull off to get back to the fifth G string. I'm the same here, just picking the fifth G here and the sixth G I hammer on and pull off. Everything is, uh, yeah, it's done with my little pinky here, okay? All right. So, that's the G sharp. And the final chord A, um, the grip will be like this. Okay, uh, it could sound like this. All right, so that is uh, open A, seventh D, fifth B, six on the G string two times, then fifth on the B, and back to 
6 on G. So, that was the A. And this melody here will go round and round for the rest of this song here. If you wish, you could add in this chords uh, like we learned for the first verse here. Just to have some variation and don't have to like picking notes and think too much. Just, yeah, take the chords and just uh, follow with the, with the rhythm here. Uh, and you can go back and forth with this melody. But that is one variation of playing this uh, Khalid song called open so yeah guys good luck with this one and i hope this was helpful for you show me if it was thumb up this one and subscribe if you haven't yet so that would be great for me that's the only thing i'm asking for you just to be a member of this uh, channel here this family and we we'll do this together so see you soon guys don't forget play tuned mm -hmm.